Hey guys, Colbert here. Welcome to another Ray Challenge video. Guys, this phone will be a showcase of a specific champion that looks very, well, that does something very similar to what Ethos does. Did you guys know that there's another champion that has an exact same skill like Ethos? If you didn't know, Ethos is one of the greatest uh, void nuking champions. Look at the skill, uh, Extinguish. This attack will always be critical. It's an AoE attack that definitely nukes out enemies. If you built him with just critical damage, you can do that and just nuke out waves with this one. Uh, fantastic skill. I wish there were more champions with this kit, but there is actually an uncommon champion within the game that has exactly this skill. And we're gonna go over that and a common champion. I've built it out. I'm not on the test server or anything. I'm on my main account. So I did dedicate these resources. So you better click that like button and the subscribe button if you haven't already. So let's go over and see where this champion is. There it is, Battle Sister. Don't mistake here with Sister Militant. This one's an a common attack based champion. Look at the gear that I have, guys. Uh, it's pretty, pretty heavy, right? So let's go over the skills and what makes her the specific new king champion that we want to see. It's not her A1, her A1 attacks one enemy, decreases diameter by 10% if this attack is critical. Nothing too crazy about that. Although it does have a nice multiplier. Condemn her A2. Attacks one enemy, 15% chance of removing one random buff from the target. Who cares about that? This attack is always critical. This is why Battle Sister will be the showcase for today. For today's video, we'll build her with as much damage as possible. We even picked up Masteries. Hell Smasher right here, picking all the Masteries that give us maximum amount of damage. Even Support Tree getting Lord of Steel to give us that extra little bit of critical damage. And this is the first time in my two years of making videos that have done this, this mastery right here, Blade Disciple, just 75 attack instead of the critical rate uh, mastery right here. <laughs> it's the first time I've done it, honestly. Uh, I don't even know, I don't even know um, why, but I mean, that 75 attack, I, I thought, okay, it's gonna give me a little bit more damage. So, Savage Gear and, um, and Critical Damage Gear, not focusing at all for any critical rate. And let's look at the overall stats. We've got attack percent there, critical damage, attack and attack percent. Our speed is very low, 141, almost 5,000 attack there. 314 critical damage on this at common. And we better see some big numbers because, uh, well, I've done some testing. I know, I know she does big numbers, but I wanna see if we can get maybe some bigger numbers on this showcase. I'm expecting, you know, I've done these showcases before on other commons. I've done 400,000 crits, so I'm expecting more than that, honestly. So let's go and see. Uh, you guys know the build that I do for these kind of videos. Uh, I'm going to go into the Ice Columns pick. Let's do 20. Um, well, 24 is going to have higher levels, and it's going to be much tougher to actually get those big numbers, higher defense, higher health. So we'll do 20, where we're going to be strong affinity. Here's the build. We're going to be strong affinity. Everybody's going to be ready to uh, to see th see those big hits. But I wonder, I wonder, I just wonder how much damage we can do. So uh, let's do the defense down weekend. Uh, we did get the defense down weekend on everybody. Let's do the poisons. So what this gives me is uh, basically battle class are 20% there, defense down weekend, and then the poisons from Gertug and attack up uh, buff from Arbiter. And that's basically it in terms of, you know, um, setting up the damage dealer so let's go and see uh, i am expecting a big big number always critical hit let's go over on this drake in the middle boom 354,000. pretty good if you ask me 354,000. i bet we could get this bit higher though because i did get it a bit higher with other uh other champions so i am expecting with the amount of critical damage that we have to get to get some good numbers here. So uh, she's gonna get another attack here with the A1. Boom, look at that, 333,000 330, with just the A1. So they probably have like a similar multiplier, uh, both her A1 and her A2, uh, which, makes, which makes it funny because I mean, her A2 depends on having an always critical. Haven't even checked the actual multiplier, so. Um, I might be mistaken, but just for, through the numbers, it means that she has some proper 
uh, probably damage on that A1. So uh, no buffs here, just the attack above. Look at that, 128,000. So we've got three kills so far. Uh, remember, we do get some added damage through uh, our masteries whenever we get a kill with Battle Sister. So I'm setting her up for the second wave, honestly, now. So this is why I'm just uh, using A1s with everybody. So that Battle Sister can uh, take this kill here. 145,000 and should be able to kill this one pretty quickly. Just with single targeting skills, don't kill anybody, please. And our setup for, for wave number two should give us those pretty big numbers, right? No crit here, come on. You can't even debuff this one to test, test out things. Okay, let's go to wave two. Wave two should be the one that gives us um, the big numbers now. So we also need to get Hell Smasher to proc, by the way, it's a 50% chance. So he might not even proc be proccing here uh, on these enemies when we attack. So let's go, let's go. Let's put it on 1x speed. Look at that, 426,539. Ooh, that's a much bigger number, right? Over 400,000 crit. Um, and when I honestly, when I was doing my testing, I actually got a pretty bigger number. I actually got a 493,000 when I was doing my other testing, 320,000 on the A1. I would imagine that any champion with this gear and this setup does big numbers, but remember this is an uncommon champion. Battle Sister, one attack uh, going in there. Nothing more than that. And uh, we're just gonna go to the next to the next round and actually hit the boss and see how much we can do on the boss. 223,000. And remember, we've got like 20% chance to crit. Uh, but we do have the extra chance to crit because of uh, of Bad Alcazar. So let's do the defense down, weaken on everybody. There we go. Poisons added 20% damage. Poisons on ourselves. Attack up buff by Arbiter. And let's see how much damage we do to the boss where we are, Strong Affinity. The two adds on the sides are Void. So I wonder how much we can do on the boss here. 440,000. <laughs> so happy about that. Uh, pretty big number, right? So let's exit. And what I want to see next is, can we do some, um, some lower levels? Maybe if we try out 17 we should be able to get even bigger numbers, right? Because these have much lower uh, base defense. So we should be able to get the almost the absolute amount of damage out of her. So let's just do a pretty, pretty quick test here. Let's do this. Boom, 400,000. <laughs> I love that. I, I just love that. Okay, another true test is gonna be in the arena, can she go ahead, uh, go toe to toe with other strong champions in here? Uh, let's go against the first team that we find here. There we go. There's our battle sister in there. So we've got one person nuke that we can do out of all the targets that are against me right now. Uh, Catrophone went in hiding, so I should be able to take down um, her. So no defense down. Can we kill her without a defense down? I might be I might be a little bit difficult now. Um, I just want to see can we can we actually take her out without a defense down? Oh look at that fifty four thousand um, plus the damage that de uh, that was dealt on the shield. Now she's out. Uh, she's dead from Cadrophone. Um, but I mean, as a single target nuker, she does what she's supposed to. Okay. Let's see, let's uh, boost our speed up. Can we get a turn here? Oh, that Cadrophone is gonna wreck me, honestly. So my next kill, I wanna be, I want it to be one of these two guys here. She gonna get a turn, no, 100,000. 100,000 dealt on my Arbiter. I, I was expecting that. Oh, not on my Arbiter, on my Battle Sister, because uh, she's got very low. Really low defense. Oh, we're out. Okay, we're out from this battle. 
So we couldn't kill Kadra from there because he was just hiding throughout the battle. Can we take out any of these? Hmm. There's going to be another test here. So we speed boost. Decrease the perimeter of the enemies. So here, who do I want to kill out of all of these? Honestly, I want to kill the Reviver. So it's going to be Duchess. Here we go, 170,000. Again, that's what I wanted to see here. We want to remove that perimeter. He did a refresh. Um, so everybody's going to be doing their skills again. I'm more afraid of that Mountain King than anything else. Because he's going to go crazy on my team. Ooh, didn't hit that hard. Oh, Relentless said, okay. I get it. So we'll get a revive. Terminator boost. Oof. Okay, can we remove the shields? Nope. Can we get a kill on her? And now with Battle Sister. Come on, Battle Sister, show your true worth here. Um, we want to see knocking one of these two out. Oh, it's going to be... It's going to be... Impossible to beat, um, to beat him. Oh, look at that, <laughs> a strong attack, non-crit. We took her down. Uh, it's gonna be impossible to kill Mountain King with Bow Sister. She's weak affinity, so. Oh man, is he gonna take out the whole team? Ooh, probably. Oh yeah. Can we get his Terminator? There we go. Okay, that's what I wanted to see. So do a heal here. Arbiter is protected a little bit. 29k. Okay. Steal some Terminator. Let's revive everybody. Ah, gotta remove that counter attack buff. That's killing me more than the actual uh, champion. Okay, let's heal. Okay, finally we remove the buff. Uh, remove his Terminator and then Battle Sister should just take. Take him out here. Boom! 185,000 uh, on Mountain King. So let's see. Can we find more tanky champions here? So this guy, uh, 300,000 team. We are going to be faster here. So that's the important thing. Again, I need to take out the Reviver. Because that's the only way with Battle Sister here to actually be... Ah, uh, the shields. Okay, can we still take her out? <laughs> 135,000. Very nice. Love it. Love it. Love it. And I'm almost going to take out this Rotos, right? Okay, we've got a fear there. There it is. Okay, took out Rotos. And boom, 36,000. On her A1, by the way. And then it should be an easy win after this on Prince Kaimar. <laughs> okay, we we got slept there, but we're gonna revive now with with Arbiter, and it should be just a win, easy win after this. Ocean. Come on, are you gonna not gonna revive Battle Sister? Okay, he's out, and we should be able to keep on fighting. So, next up, uh, who are we going to try? We need to try a big, big target. So, this one's a CNL team. I just want to see if we can take out, honestly, if we can take out Sifi with Bile Sister. Can we take out Sifi? So, she's going to be Void, so we're not going to be Strong Affinity. If we manage to take out the Shields, then we should be okay with the defense down, right? Mm, okay, just have to see. Let's see. Boom, 108,000. Take out the Terminator. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's oh, it's gonna be insane. Can we give a there we go? Block debuffs buff. So when she attacks him, look at that, 39,000. When she attacked him, uh, she wouldn't get a an attack down and a defense down. So what I want to see now is my battle sister taking a turn and taking out that Duchess. That's gonna be my only. Oof! 
my only way to to do anything here. Come on. Can we get a turn? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, look at that. <laughs> look at that double kill. <laughs> I did not expect a double kill there from uh, Bow Sister. Wow, wow, wow. We definitely took out that team. <laughs> oh man. And these guys are gonna be checking their defense log and they're they're gonna be seeing that Bow Sister attacking them. And they will be like, what? What just happened? How did my defense lose from a <laughs> how did my defense lose from a pile sister? So the same thing here. Uh we're gonna try and kill the reviver. Problem is there's a Lydia there, which is it's just gonna mess things up more than anything, honestly. Uh, because if my battle sister dies, um, yeah, if my battle sister dies, I'm I'm pretty much doomed. Can I take out? Can I take out warlord? Yeah, I'll just go for arbiter just for sake of it. Look at that, one hundred sixteen thousand. Uh, but the thing is, this combo is is unbeatable because if yeah, <laughs> it's unbeatable with this team because, um, man. <laughs> but two battle sister did take the kill there on Arbiter. So I'm happy about that. So this was the showcase, guys. Total fun showcase. I love doing these videos uh, on, you know, the hidden gem champions out there that might have something that's that nobody ever thought, okay, should I try this? But battle sister definitely, um, definitely deserves the spot there. That specific skill that gives her an always critical plus all the critical damage, plus the savage gear, just makes her so special in this fun showcase. Don't go out to level up a battle sister uh, thinking she'll do the same thing. Remember, I've got good gear, maxed out, great haul on everything. So it definitely does help uh, making these champions just uh, shine extra, extra more, um, extra more. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. And guys, I'll see you in the next one. See ya.